Hey, welcome back to Luigi's Mansion. Yep. We're getting close to the end here. We, get, we got nine more booze. Yep. And I think two or three more boss ghosts. It'll still be a, a good while yet, though. Yeah. So now they got a baby girl. Yep. Don't try to wake me. Go away. I actually forgot. <laughs> you just go away. <laughs> I like the thing I like about this game is that each different boss ghost has a little something that you have to do to make their heart visible. See this girl? You have to make her wet the bed. So you just gotta piss the... Oh shit. Oh shit, is her little clown after me? I think you sucked it up. Oh, okay. Never... Oh wait, no, no, we didn't. Man, this is a polder guy shit. Hey, it's the clown what from the fucking Pine View. Clown from Pine View. Oh uh, yeah. Fuck off. God damn, like it hits me while I'm down. It's coming. It's coming. The clown. Come on, bro. Oh shit. What's wrong? We, we left the AC on. Oh shit. Oh good. Sorry about that, y'all. Here it is. It just gets really hot in here, and we we take breaks every like five minutes to turn on the AC. Yep. Oh yeah, there's a boo in here, huh? Yes, I see that the room has switched orientations. So I just gotta remember that was two minutes long. I can isolate the noise and get rid of it. Yeah, if it's even there, yeah. it, which it probably is, since we got a better mic. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and uh, we have the live commentary at very high right now. Oh, yeah. Why is this one only got like 100 health? That's weird. Maybe it's got more rooms to jump between. You're mine, son. Um, you stop booze like a master. Heal the fearless boo hunter. Um, uh,. Where's the map? Do I have a key? Ah, oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, I'll yeah. Upstairs. I has key. Why is it still dark up here? Oh, it's dark because there are no lights on. Shut up, Blake. We got plenty of Blake stories we want to tell at some point. Did I already tell the Blake story about it be enough? I think so. Enough. Or maybe you were just telling that to me. Enough! I guess uh, we can actually tell that one, just in case we didn't, because it's actually a pretty funny one. Okay. There's this guy. Okay, I'll, I'll let you start this story out, because... There was a uh, guy we knew back when we were uh, like in high school. We used to get together with a bunch of friends <clears throat> and play airsoft. And yeah. Uh, yeah, Colton knew the guy a lot longer than I did. Yeah, so. and the guy who uh, basically we played at this dude's house, and uh, the guy whose house we played at had an older brother. And he was, he was a cool guy. He was kind of strange at times, though. And that, that was Blake. And a lot of times he made these, uh, like, really obvious statements, which is what I was doing just then, whenever I said, oh, well, it's dark because, because there are no lights on, or whatever. So, uh, yeah, that's Blake. So, Steve, I'll let you continue the story. Okay, anyway, so one time... Like, uh, we were all, like, messing around with each other, like we usually do, you know, like, saying, like, fuck you, Colton, and all that stuff, and yeah. I forgot what Chris Cleveland was doing to, uh, to, um, 
Blink. Blink. But I think we all started like egging him on or something. Yeah. It's just that whenever you have one of those friends that takes something too seriously, you 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 like you push him. Blake Blake was actually a really cool guy. I have to yeah. say, he made really good uh, red beans. Oh, and hell tea. yeah! So we used to talk about that all the time. Blake's beans and tea. Yeah, he could have actually made a business with that shit. Blake's beans and tea. And uh, anyways, the story goes that uh, we keep we have so many stories to tell about Blake. Yeah. But uh, what the time we're talking about is uh, everybody started like egging him on and and. Uh, he like slammed his fist on the table and he just screamed, ENOUGH! And like, and of every course that... everyone just started laughing. Yeah. <laughs> Great, uh, I'm, I'm glad to know that he actually took it as a joke though. ENOUGH! Well, at the time, he, he was being serious, but... Yeah. And he went along with the with our jokes most of the time. Yeah. The... Like, he knew we, you know, made the jokes about you know, his obvious statement, which, which I guess we, uh, we call him his Blake comments. Just, uh, well, actually... Yeah, they all started with that, uh, well, actually... Yeah, he, he'd always say that. And he didn't really sound like that, that's just our... You know, how, oh, shit, how you do. Hey, huh, and he close. knew everything about Halo. Yeah, he was, he was a really smart guy. Yeah, he, like, he had one of those memories that you can, uh pretty much tell them something, like, a year ago, and they'll remember the exact words. Yeah. Oh, wow. That spawned right on top of me. Yeah, that's a, that's that's just one of many stories about Blake. And, uh, I'm sure... I'm sure, like, uh, we'll t be telling plenty of stories about, uh, our friends and shit. Wait, is this a fake door? Yeah, it's not. One fifty. Underboo is making a comeback. He's like an indie dog. You fucker. Is there another one in here? Did one escape from us? You know what you should tell? Huh? The story about uh what Razu guy, what was his name? Mr. Words. Yeah, Mr. Words. He was a great guy. Uh my Freshman year, my uh, I never had a physical teacher. science teacher. Cool, uh, also really cool guy. But uh, that's a fake one. Yeah, what the hell? Wait, is the map trying to screw me over here? Oh wait, I was looking at a. Oh, it's gonna. Is it gonna like send me all up and down here? Yes, it is. Um, I went the wrong way. I'm sorry. I'm losing my train of thought. Mr. Wirtz, yeah. Really funny guy. Uh, I don't know. I don't know where to start the story. You can't, so you can't, you can't tell the Razzie one. Huh? Tell, the, tell him the Razzie one. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking of. Okay, so, I don't know I don't know what was going on. It, it was science class, so there was always some something happening. Some, you know, in-class experiment or something. But he, uh, I don't know. One day he just... <laughs> Brought out a tin, a box of dominoes, you know, like a tin box. <laughs> and he was trying to open them up, and I guess it slipped out of his hand or something, and they just, all the dominoes just flew everywhere. <laughs> and he just yells out, he just goes, Razoo! <laughs> Razoo! I think that got really loud, and I, I apologize if that was really loud. And for some reason, like, I didn't know what it meant, I guess. So, so just the other day, we looked it up on Urban Dictionary, and apparently it's what people would yell out whenever they were playing a marbles or whatever and it uh it's what you would yell out to your friend who was playing marbles and basically when you yelled out razu your friend would like steal all the other guys marbles and just run off i've never played marbles so i don't really know what it was like <laughs> so i guess people just stole each other's marbles but yeah razu and that was whatever that means i i wish i had mr words as a teacher from all the stories that like, you guys tell me about him. I'm gonna... What did he say one time? He was like, I'm gonna take a bicycle, I'm gonna ride it to the moon. Vroom, vroom. <laughs> I really want to meet this guy. That was after he retired, I think. 
Or no, maybe not. That was like right before he retired. I'm going to grow my eyes, eyebrows out really long until I can wrap them around my head and you can call me the Great Wizard. Uh, he'd really say that? Uh, apparently he said that to uh, somebody one time. This was after, again, after he retired. You bang, sure bang. Mr. Words ain't crazy or something? He, he might be a little bit crazy. Bang, bang, you're dead. Brooke Jacobs. Oh, God. God, I don't know... He was fucking weird, dude. He really was, whenever I think about it now. He like, I wasn't in this class. We, we'll have to get Chris to tell that story, like, a little better. But apparently he, like, he took, he made his fingers into little, like, devil horns on his head. And he just started, like, jumping up and down and making weird... Keep in mind, this is a teacher. Yeah. Making, like, weird noises. And he's like, yeah, Or something like that. And he's just, like, jumping up and down in front of this girl. Her name was Brooke. And he's like, are you scared now, Brooke? Yeah! <laughs> I wish I had this guy for my teacher. That would have... Maybe I wouldn't have dropped out of high school. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! And he probably didn't make that sound. That's probably just an exaggeration. Well, you know, you know, we... we all, oh, there's this guy again. We, we always just friggin... Wait, I'm really confused. Boo, boo, boo B Hatch. Was he? Uh, I thought he was upstairs. I guess this not. This is crazy Boo walking. No, why? Yeah, go that way. Yeah, that's all the Mr. Wirt stories I can think of right now. What? Oh, son of a bitch. Huh? Did he just go into the ground? No, he just... <coughs> I'm sorry about that, y'all. Well... Is there another... Uh, yeah, I think there is another boo in here, because, uh... You little bastard. Boom, boom. Straight to the moon. Freeze the ectoplasm. Are you scared now, bro? Yeah! <laughs> I wonder if you actually have to turn that off. Yeah, I guess you do. I'm gonna go find this boo now. Arr, you must walk the plank. God. Nice hair, Green. Dude, come back. Wow, this one. He's just dragging me around. That's pretty cool. No. As soon as I say something. Ah. Oh. Okay, so now we got like three of them in that room over there. Which I'm pretty sure is the ice room, which is a really annoying room. Yeah. There, there's one, only one story I can think of in high school uh -huh. that I can tell. And I don't know if you want me to tell it. Um... After this video, tell me about it, and then we'll uh, decide. I, I, I'll, I'll give you a hint. I'm ready. No, don't tell it. Please don't. That's a very personal story. I don't know. No. <laughs> I'm ready. That's the only magnificent thing I've ever seen happen in high school. You're making it too hot! I'm gonna cook in this heat. Do you like those fires? Yeah, who else would have done it? I don't remember if this fight was like really hard or not. Because like the icicles or whatever. Oh, he's an Eskimo game. Yeah. Okay, I gotta straighten this player again. Ah. Here, let me get another player. Oh. oh yeah, I got I got a good story to tell. What's up? About how I how I met you guys. Uh huh. Like uh basically and uh I I didn't really have any friends in high school. Like, I'm not exaggerating about that at the time. And, uh, 
Basically, I was just sitting in the library one day, just minding my own fucking business like I usually do. Like I usually did with my, uh, my baby looking, like, ass just sitting there in the back of the library during <laughs> lunchtime. And, uh, for some reason, I just, like, eavesdrop on other people's conversations. I know it sounds creepy, but whatever, you don't have any friends. Like, the, the best, the b best entertainment you can get is listening to how fucking stupid other people can be. Which is true. And, uh, so one day, I, I was sitting in the library, and there's this group of four people that would usually come in there, and they would sit down, like, a little bit away from me. But this time, they were sitting really close, so I was able to hear exactly what they were going to say. And Colton was among that group. Oh, God, did I say something? No. He, he you, 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 you were actually very quiet. Yeah. And, like, I heard... That's whenever I first met all of them, so... It was, uh, I think it was Chris, you, and, uh, those two women that we're not gonna, like, uh, mention. Yeah. Or was it Nick? Oh, yeah, Nick was probably there, too. Yeah, there's someone was five Carbon. people. Man, I haven't seen him since high school. Yeah, I haven't seen him in a while. Hey, Nick, if, uh, you're watching this video, uh, hit us up sometime. Yeah. You know who you are. Yeah, we know who you are. No, he knows who we are. Or whatever. Well, he knows who he is, that's what I'm saying. And, uh, anyway, so I'm, I'm sitting there, and they say something really stupid. I don't, I don't even remember what it was. I literally couldn't hold back my laughter. And then this one, the one chick... Um... Uh, what? There, there we go. Uh, I, I just couldn't get that friggin' boo. The one chick literally just walks up, and keep in mind, at the time, I'm like a sophomore. And, uh... Nah, you are probably a junior. Junior? Yeah, because I was a sophomore. Oh, well, I, I was holding back, held back like a few years. And, uh... And, uh... Basically, she, she literally forced me to come sit with you guys. And that's one thing I'll always be appreciative of her for. And yeah. I, I won't say her name. Even though we've been name-throwing the whole time, but... Yeah. It's one of those things. And, uh... And so, that's how I pretty much met Colton. And that's the story. That's the story all about how our mm -hmm. life got flipped, turned upside down. And uh, basically, I just became his friend because I was eavesdro eavesdropping on his conversations. Nice. <laughs> See, sometimes being a, a stalker can be a good thing. Not really. But I most don't... of the time it's not. Yeah, most of the time it's not. Yeah, whenever I look back on it, I didn't, really didn't have that many friends in high school. Brandon was one of them. Brandon's really cool. Yeah. Alex is really cool. Oh, yeah. You know, Alex Hughes. Oh, Alex Hughes. I thought you'd heard about, uh, Restrepo. Yeah, Al Alex... I, I didn't, didn't really know we Alex. We were really friends with her in high school, though. Yeah. She, she was actually my, uh, drill sergeant in ROTC. And I was actually terrified of her. <laughs> because she was actually really good at what she did. And she's like five foot. Yeah. But she she, she got the presence down to an art. Whenever yeah. it came to that. Uh -huh. And uh Yeah, Ian was cool, Alex Hughes. Uh Hey, Alex is probably watching this. You better be. Is he? Yeah. Hey Alex! Hi. We're just gonna be talking about our friends. Hey, it's good stories to tell. Yep. Yes, I saw the boo. He was so fast. Six more. And a few other names I'm not gonna name. Yeah. Some names just aren't happy stories. Yeah. No, don't go in the hallway. Stop. Okay. Oh yeah, Nathan's pretty cool as well. Yeah. He was pretty cool. He was like one of our first subscribers. Was he? I think so. Oh, okay. Uh, 
Colton knows more about the uh, subscribers than I do. I'm, I'm not just saying that just to kiss y'all's asses. <laughs> <laughs> now look, I, uh, we're about out of time for this video. We got, got caught up in the reminiscing. So hey, if you like our videos, be sure to like, subscribe, share with your friends. You know, same shit I say every time. Thanks for watching.